You know, when are you fake Resident Evil fans going to wake up and, I don't know, smell the coffee? I'm a world-class veteran video game critic. I've been with the Resident Evil franchise since day one. I'm a real Resident Evil fan, unlike you. You came from Fortnite to this all-new edition of Resident Evil 2, and now you think, Oh, Michael, I have that certified badge. No. And I know you also subscribe to Residents of Evil. They shill. That's what they do. They are in bed with Capcom. And I'm over here pushing really hard and really strong to step up to that plate to say, hey, you know what? Maybe the lazy millennial devs over at Clueless Capcom aren't on the right track. You know what I mean? I'm brutally critical because I care. I don't hate this franchise. I don't hate the lazy millennial devs over at Clueless Capcom. Again, I'm brutally critical because I care. I want to see this franchise get back on the right track. But how? How? Let me ask you fake Resident Evil fans this. How can that happen when, again, you came from Fortnite to this all-new edition of Resident Evil 2, and now you've infested the Resident Evil franchise? And as such, this all-new upcoming edition of Resident Evil 3 is already a bestseller on Amazon. And I can't help but ask, why? Why are you giving Capcom your money? They have nothing to show for. We've seen at least as of this recording, maybe what? 15 or so seconds of actual gameplay, and yet there you fake Resident Evil fans are, oh, shut up and take my money, Capcom, because you don't actually care about quality. You care about style, presentation, and graphics. You don't care about the nuts and bolts of how these games work. You don't care about the longevity. You don't care about the replayability. You couldn't care less. And it's incredibly sad. And not only is it incredibly sad, but it's one of the reasons why this franchise is in the shitter. But you don't care. And you never will. Because you're too busy going, 